Raising yourself inside is what's pretty hot right now. <laughs> Cryotherapy has become more and more popular over the past few years, and many people are paying a lot of money to get blasted with air as cold as 200 degrees below zero. It's so crazy. Yeah, those who swear by its benefits say it can reduce pain, improve recovery time, even help with weight loss. But what are the cold, hard facts about cryotherapy? I tried it out and sat down with a doctor to see what all the hype is about. have been going crazy about cryotherapy. Everyone from Lindsay Lohan to Mandy Moore and Will Smith. Any inflammation you got is going to knock it out. It is also taking the pro sports world by storm. LeBron James, Floyd Mayweather, and Steph Curry among the athletes who have tried it and tout the benefits. I just feel like it makes me you'll feel better and makes me, helps me recover fast, though. So. No pain, no gain. Developed in Japan in the late 70s to help treat rheumatoid arthritis, cryotherapy has been gaining steam here in the United States states over the last decade. Supporters say exposing themselves to the cold, dry air for about three minutes has a number of health benefits from melting fat, boosting energy, and soothing sore muscles to helping with chronic pain. In fact, Allison Tanner believes in cryotherapy so much that last year she left her job as a police officer and decided to open Kerr Recovery Spa in Old Sabra. Reception from the community has been amazing. Um, so we, we knew we hit the right spot when we you know, everyone welcomed us with open arms. Business is now booming, but beyond the dollars and cents, she says being able to offer this service is very rewarding. It's neat to see their face when they get out and they say, oh my gosh, I actually feel good. Tim Ratta is one of Tanner's loyal clients. An avid runner, Ratta credits cryotherapy treatments with helping his body bounce back more quickly from training sessions. In fact, he recently ran two marathons in a week, winning the second race. I recover from hard workouts faster and uh, any, I have a nagging ankle injury and um, it kind of helps with that. Oh, so I decided to try it out to see what all the hype is about. After filling out the form, I was almost ready to go. Getting real. I put on a robe and then needed a few essential items. I was given special socks, shoes, and gloves to protect my fingers and toes. How are you doing? I'm ready. Game time. I'm really not ready. <laughs> Total lie. <laughs> There's no turning back now. Yes, I know. Oh! Right, so, go ahead and throw me the room, even though you don't want to. It was time to step into the machine filled with the freezing liquid nitrogen gas. No big deal. The chamber, a cool negative 133 degrees. Bruce to Priest, it's freezing in here. The next minute is the hardest part. Okay. This is where your skin temperature is dropped. It's going down at least 30 degrees. And then minutes two to three get a little easier? Yes. All right, I'm going to keep turning there you here. Go, yeah. Holy moly, it's freezing. But you're halfway. You can do anything for three minutes. Wow. Three minutes, my treatment was complete. I did it! I feel like a new woman. <laughs> you do get warm right away. Yeah. After my plunge to the frosty temperatures, I thawed out with a trip to see Dr. Devika Umashankar. She's an obesity medicine specialist with Hartford Healthcare. She explained exactly what happens to your body during a cryotherapy treatment. When people are submerged into extremely cold temperatures, um, their body goes into a survival mechanism mode. Um, and what this allows is, it allows robust production of endorphins, allows people's blood circulation to maximize. In terms of weight loss, Dr. Umashankar says so far she has not recommended cryotherapy as a tool, citing a lack of research. But she says there is some data to show it could be beneficial for those with rheumatoid arthritis, fibromyalgia, and migraines. She hopes more studies are conducted in the future. The fact that people on an off-label approach find therapeutic alleviation of their symptoms is fantastic. That's how science grows. That's how research grows and that's what will allow us to have another way of treating these chronic diseases. So to freeze or not to freeze, the choice is yours. And some say it's an easy decision. You recover faster, you can train harder. If you train harder, you're going to perform better. It's done! Yay! 
we're never going to be able to get those images out of anyone's head there. Now, of course, we want to remind you to check with your doctor before starting any treatment. It is not for everyone, including people who are pregnant, have a heart condition, or suffer from blood clots. The cost of the first session at Kerr is $25. A 10-pack goes for about $300. So, hope everyone enjoyed that. Yeah, it's pretty interesting. I tried it one time, too. Mark did it as well. I did. so shocking to me. I, I lived near the location there yeah. in Old Saybrook, and I stopped in. She's very nice, and I gave it a try. It was neat. Yeah. Um, that last minute, though, is it's hard. pretty intense. It's a long three minutes. I said it's not painful. It's manageable, but it's it's tough. They also say it helps with sleeping. She told me yes. that too, which they that say that night can help you'll sleep well. Yeah. 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 Well.